Prince Harry steps out solo amid a report Meghan Markle cut back schedule on royal tour. Prince Harry steps out without Meghan Markle. The pregnant Duchess of Sussex was scheduled to accompany her husband to the 2018 Invictus Games cycling and sailing competitions at Sydney Olympic Park on Sunday Australia time. However, the Duke of Sussex was solo while meeting with athletes on day two of the event. Meghan and Harry have decided to slightly cut back her schedule for the next couple of days. According to multiple reports, the Duke will attend the cycling as scheduled this morning, and the Duchess will join him for this afternoon's engagements, Kensington Palace told Mail Online. The Duke will continue with the engagements on Fraser Island as planned. ET has reached out to Kensington Palace and the couple's reps for comment. A source told the publication that it wasn't that Meghan was feeling sick. They are just trying to pace her given how many engagements she has coming up. The couple is set to attend a lunchtime reception hosted by the Prime Minister, with Invictus Games competitors and representatives from the community in the city's central parkland the domain. The night before, Harry took the stage during the Games opening ceremony to thank everyone for the warm welcome, and share how special the Invictus Games are to him. I have been so proud to be able to introduce my wife to you and we have been so happy to be able to celebrate the personal joy of our newest addition with you all," he said. Our Invictus family has turned these games into a symbol of strength, honor and optimism for a new generation. Earlier this week, Meghan, who announced this week that she is pregnant with her first child, was trying to keep her mental health in check. During her fourth day of tour events, she joined Harry at Bondi Beach where the couple met with the group One Wave to have an open discussion about mental health. One woman in the group, 35-year-old Charlotte, spoke with the Duchess about pregnancy, as she too is expecting. Meghan told me that pregnancy was like having jet lag, Charlotte told reporters. She said she was up at 4.30 a.m. this morning doing yoga in her room as she couldn't sleep. It's a bit of a double whammy for her, she said as she has both the baby and jet lag to contend with. Meghan added that yoga is so good for healing your mind. There's still plenty of days left in their two-week tour of Australia, Fiji, Tonga, and New Zealand. See what they have been up to since arriving down under earlier this week.